Hi everybody. I just woke up and I had to share my dream. Um, it was a lucid dream and it was about uh, Lauren Pritchard. And um, I've kind of, um, after she came back, I kind of have clicked in here and there when she does live streams. She's kind of done a, a burst of live streams um, uh, maybe a week ago. And um, she just doesn't acknowledge at all what like happened before. Um, she's gotten more religious. She she prays over her what she says so she used she used to not do that before where she's like holy jesus please protect me blah 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 blah. please protect the chat from um watching floor burn and then she just like played all of floor burn's latest video a lot of people are pushing floor burn um i just find it astonishing that floor burn can not have her channel canceled and have 52,000 views on a totally uncensored rant about every topic that gets everybody else banned and like immediately have their channel shut down like she can just blah 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 blah, blah from Colombia with her weird virus you know painting behind her but whatever and then we have people like pushing Fleur Burn like I think Marfugel pushed her like mentioned her Lauren Pritchard played her I want to say like Mr. MBB like somebody new recommended Fleur Burn which I thought was interesting but maybe it was like a prepper channel or something like that that had it but um I think Fleur Burn is super sus but anyways, Lauren Pritchard, she started making videos again. People have made videos about Lauren saying that she was a clone and I kind of just laughed it off. But recently she was giving such super clone energy. Like she keeps changing her appearance like dramatically. Like one day she looked like she had a wig on almost. It was so perfectly blonde. It looked like fake hair. And then she had like the dark black eyeliner with like blue eyeshadow, like super done up. She looked like a Stepford wife. She looked like an Android Stepford. I mean, she looked beautiful. She looked awesome. She looked put together. She looked like she just, you know, got back from a, like, like it looked like she got done up for like an event. Like she got glammed up, but maybe she had just gotten done with a client and she, dresses up for her clients. I don't know. And then the next day she's like, you know, wire rim glasses. Oh, I didn't mean to do that symbol on you guys, but like wire rim glasses and just no makeup, just very dramatic appearance changes. Um, I just remembered, I still don't know what happened to Jerry, her cat and the boyfriend, um, I just saw that one time in that edited video she put together of her little vacation. So anyway, so I'll click into her videos and kind of like observe her and she was like, she was like getting super religious and praying over things. I don't like praying. I don't like praying to, to anybody. I don't like praying outside of yourself. So anytime somebody prays over me or starts calling on entities and protection, I like tap out of that stuff. I don't like that stuff. But um, anyway, so my dream, I was in a, like a cafeteria. I thought I was, I thought I was in real life. Like I thought it was awake. I, w I didn't think I was in a dream. Um, it was kind of like, I w it wasn't a Harry Potter cafeteria. It was more like a modern cafeteria, like modern tables. And she was sitting, she was like gathered, all these people were sitting around her and she was like talking and she was like telling stories. And I was kind of off to the side and I think I had my cell phone and I was watching Lauren Pritchard, 
her the one the more recent videos where she looks like a clone and she's all done up with hair and makeup i was like watching my her video on my phone while i'm while i'm watching her talk in person to these people and i'm kind of comparing her in real life to what she looks like on my phone and thinking about how she looks like a clone how she has this clone energy and so then i walk over to her and like she's sitting down at the cafeteria table and i'm like standing up and I'm like about to sit down like at the table across the table from her. And she's talking about Jesus and it's like I know what I what what I'm going to say is going to get immediately rejected. So I like I just start like blurting it out, like just start saying it to her and I'm like what do I say? I say um like, there is no sin. Jesus erased the sin. Like, people just don't understand the story of Jesus. Um, he erased the law. There is no more sin anymore. Um, I'm like, if Jesus died for your sins, therefore there is no more sin. Like, you can't... I think I, I, I put up this example in my dream, but it like made sense. I was like, you can't get... You can't get mad at a baby for spilling milk if there was no rule about spilling milk in the first place. He never broke a rule. Like if there is no more rules to be broken, you can never sin. Like if there are no rules, you can never be evil because you never break the rules. And then I said like, um, Jesus was against Moses. Jesus was against the Ten Commandments. Jesus was against the law he erased the law and then I'm like Moses had horns like and then she's like she's kind of like she was kind of like flabbergasted kind of just like like she was like getting hit with all this and she like stands up and she's like come with me and so I like walk over to the edge of the table with Lauren Pritchard and like I'm kind of like thinking that she's just gonna be like get out of here like I don't want to hear that stuff and she's like I need, like, it was like she wanted me to get away from the people that she was preaching to. And then she's like, she's like, here, like, we need to talk. Like, I want to be your friend. And she hands me this uh, yellow legal pad of paper, no paper, to write down my name and my number. And I start writing, she hands me a pen and I start writing my name. And <laughs> my, the pen won't work. And I say out loud in my dream I'm like I'm like trying to write my name I'm like K and it's like the ink only comes out like like on the second line of the K so then I have to go back and I'm like trying to like get the ink to come out on the pen and and it's like you know I'm pressing so hard it's like starting to rip through the paper and then like I then I'll like scribble it out and then I'll start over in another spot of the paper and I'm just like I say out loud I'm like this is just like my dreams where you, you know, like in your dream where you're writing and nothing comes out and you can't write what you want to write. And Lauren kind of just laughs, like laughs at me, kind of like, yeah, you're weird. <laughs> you know, like, kind of like, oh, yeah, yeah. Because when I, when I talk about that, it's like people don't know what I mean. But I'm, in my dream, I'm like, this is just like my dreams where, where I'm like totally pathetic. Like I can't, do the simplest task and like I'm explaining this and I'm starting over again starting over again and I'm like totally fucking up her piece of paper that used to be like a pristine yellow piece of lined paper now it's like has all these scribbles because I can't write my own name down so finally I get like the chicken scratch name out and then I'm writing my phone number I write the wrong number I write like the wrong area code. So I'm like, fuck. And then I like scratch it out. Then I write it again. And I feel like I'm like a total retard. Like I can't remember. Like I'm just trying so hard to get the information out correctly in the writing. Because it's not like going through. And I'm like referencing to my dreams while I'm doing it. I'm like, this is just like my dreams where I can't, can't do it. Like why can't I do it? <coughs> So finally, I um, I write the right number out, and then and then I woke up.
So that's it. That was my dream about Lauren Pritchard. I was preaching to Jesus about Lauren, to Lauren Pritchard while she was preaching to Jesus to other people. Um, but yeah, I want to know about her cat, Jerry, what happened to Jerry. Um, and yeah, I'm just, just very strange, uh, activity. But that's it. Have a nice weekend. There's the ocean. I'm gonna make some coffee. Okay.